sharing a grocery haul with you guys. This is basically what I get on a week to week basis. As a college student, some things I don't have to get every week, but this is the stuff that I run out of the fastest, like produce and things I just eat more frequently. So I went to Sprouts today and I picked up quite a bit of stuff. The first thing I got is the gluten-free English muffins. I love these. I just get the brown rice um, gluten-free English muffins and these are so good. Um, most of you know that I do follow food combining, so I am gluten-free as well, and those are a great gluten-free alternative. Another thing I go through so fast is brown rice pasta. So I picked up the brown rice pasta penne. This stuff's really good, and I love like, the texture of them. I think a lot of like gluten-free pastas are really hard because they have like weird texture, but these are like really close to just regular noodles, and I love the taste of them. So I got two bags because I actually go through these really fast. The next thing I got is just some organic cherry tomatoes. I like to put these on my like little flatbread cauliflower thin um, pizza type pesto things I make for lunches. Um, these are really good and I love the taste of them, but I also make like a pesto pasta with those. So I love cherry tomatoes. Then next I picked up some Celsius. I talk about these a lot on my channel. Um, but these are just a great way for me to get caffeine and they're pretty good for you compared to like a lot of other things that you could get. Um, I got the cucumber lime flavor, the cola flavor, and then the grapefruit flavor. I still have a couple in my fridge, but every time I go to Sprouts, I like to just stock up on some more because I never want to run out of them. Um, and what's so good about Celsius is it's healthy energy, it accelerates your metabolism and burns body fat. It has no high fructose corn syrup, no aspartame, no preservatives, no artificial colors or flavors. So it's pretty clean and it's a great way to get caffeine. Oh, and I also got the kiwi flavor. I forgot to show that one. And then another thing I picked up I've actually never tried before. I've tried some of the maca cold brews from this brand, but not any of the matchas. So I got the matcha latte and I'm super excited to try this. And there's something loud in my hallway. I don't really know what that is. <laughs> the next I got a bunch of broccoli. Um, broccoli is such a like cheap thing that I, that I add to like so many meals. And I find that it makes them more filling. So I got two crowns of broccoli. And I know this is in plastic and I'm really sorry. It makes me really sad. If you have any recommendations for bags to bring to put your produce in, please leave them linked down below because I've been trying to find some, but I just don't know which ones to get and I need to get them already because I'm tired of using the plastic ones at the store. And I think it's really ironic when I put these inside of my res my reusable bags. Like I feel like that makes me look really bad. So hopefully you guys have some recommendations. Next, I got a ton of lemons. I got six lemons and these are also like super affordable. I get three for a dollar. So a ton of lemons, I put them in my lemon water, I put them on my avocado toast, I put them on so much, I just love lemon. And then I got four avocados, love avocados for my um, avocado like English muffins in the morning. And then I also got a ton of bananas, big banana girl, love bananas. And then lastly, I got a pineapple. Um, for my fruit in the morning, I usually cut up one banana and then do some fruit with it. So I have some kiwis in my fridge right now. And then I'm going to put the pineapple with it as well. And that's actually all that I got. So something that I forgot to include is I buy a lot of my things in bulk, like the Rayo's pasta sauce. I buy them um, like multiples at a time, so I don't need to buy it weekly. Um, but I've actually started using... I've actually been using the organic tomato basil pasta sauce from Whole Foods and this is like almost as clean as Rayo's. There's like a little bit more ingredients but it's all super clean and organic and it's only $2.50 for this versus the $7.99, $8.99 um, Rayo's pasta sauce jar. So I got three of these and it was less than one jar of the Rayo's pasta sauce. So I've definitely been liking using this lately and it's saving a lot of money because I go through sauce so often. So this is something that I keep on hand in my fridge and in my pantry. This one's half used, so that's why. 
and it just lasts me all week long so I just like to keep this on hand. I also have kale and spinach and some arugula in my fridge so that's why I did not include that in that. I did not include this in the haul. I still have some of those left over and I also keep frozen veggies that I buy at the store like what I don't use I just freeze it so I have cucumbers and broccoli and a lot of that stuff in there as well. So I hope you guys enjoyed my little mini college grocery haul. Definitely let me know if you have any recommendations or things I should try um, getting. And this is super affordable. So I got all of this for like $30, I believe, which is really good. And like this is going to last me for a whole week. So super affordable. And that's all I've got. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Definitely thumbs it up if you enjoyed it. And subscribe for more videos like these. Bye, guys.